All right, so at this point, the uh, front clip has been removed, uh, as well as all the fenders, as you can see. And right now, we're taking off the radiator hose. That was the lower radiator hose. And uh, next, we'll go ahead and tackle the uh, upper radiator hose. Just some clamps there that need to be removed. Now we're going to take off the top part of the brake, master brake cylinder. So we're removing the top piece and uh, setting it aside. And now we're going to put some WD-40 on the f line fittings and drain the uh, reservoir so that we can remove the whole thing from the vehicle. So we're just using this bucket to uh, let it drain into so it doesn't get all over the shop floor. So now we are got it all drained out and now we're going to remove the two bolts from the uh, vacuum uh, boost uh, assist. And so we're just loosening those up. And we'll get that out of here. Move some wires around, get those out of our way. So next step is to remove the uh, vacuum assist from the brake booster uh, that comes from the back of the carburetor. So just labeling it so we know where it goes when we come back. So now what we're going to do is remove the uh, washer fluid. Uh, pump and the window wiper motor from the firewall. So I think there's just three or four bolts here involved and pretty easy. So once we get that out of the way, we'll set it aside and move on to the next thing. <clears throat> All right, a little soapbox here. So you can tell that the previous owner, or I don't know, two owners or whatever it was, they loved putting these little splice locks here, right? I mean, these are garbage. Do not use these. You will regret it. They will cause you nothing but electrical problems. You know, solder it together or at a minimum, use um, one of the, they're like a crimp, but they come with the solder and you just basically heat them up and the solder flows in between the two connections. I mean, that's, that's the only way to do it. Uh, unless you really want problems down the road, I wouldn't recommend doing it any other way.